Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued blind let's play Dead Rising for PlayStation. My name is the Fightless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel and today... Well today we're still reeling from ending D and I really don't know what to do. Uh, I, it's, it's just one of those things, uh, grabbing guns... Uh, guns are kind of slow in this game. I mean a chainsaw could kill the security guys pretty quick but I got quick up close. But the guns are too slow to aim, so by the time I aim and fire, they're already ripping me shredded with ARs. And I'm not really sure what to do or how to survive. Good news is though, our last play, or I should say our last save, was at 11 o'clock. So I basically did all the other stuff beforehand. So I'm not losing a lot of time when it comes to the last time we saved. I think we just gotta boogie it to get to Isabella as quick as humanly possible. We have an hour. It's gonna take more than an hour to get to a location, but we can't delay. We just gotta go knowing these guys are coming hard at 12 o'clock. You know what I mean? Well, let's see how it goes today, shall we? I hope you all having a wonderful, fantastic day today, as we, like I said, need to just boogie as fast as humanly possible. There, there can't be any time here. Do you ever wonder, like, I, I need to pause it, like, when I go back and rewatch my points, because I really feel that there's a zombie that appears behind you for a split second every time you load a screen. I, I don't know what that is, it just, it, it feels like there's always someone behind me when I load a screen. And maybe that's just paranoia or whatever, but it's just one of those things I feel that it's a true statement. Yeah, we need a boogie. Like, we can't, we can't waste any time. We, we literally have to go as fast as humanly possible here. Would it be faster? Would it be fast to use the save point? Would it be fast to go this way? Uh, her her hideout is like right here, right? So I guess it would be faster to go this way. I don't even know if you're supposed to go to the hideout or not. Like I I I, I have zero clue on what we're actually supposed to do. It, it seems to me like there's more zombies than there ever were before. I think I just drop kick that guy into oblivion. Uh, we got a level up, which is great, and an attack up. Attack increased to 200%. I wonder if that affects weapons, or it's just punching. But either way, that's a perfect time for a level up because that, that's a full heal. Okay, okay, we got 45 minutes. I think that's plenty of time because now that I know these guys are gonna drop and come in hardcore shooting, I think I could get there fast enough where I can hopefully get to Isabella beforehand. I think last time, like this gun here, I, I was trying to get that. It would be great if I had another healing item. Yeah, it would be really nice if I had another healing item. But we don't have time. We just literally don't have time. I need to get to... I, I need to get to her ASAP. Uh, I think last time I tried to go for the... Uh, for the bike. I hate that so much. I hate that even more. But well, like when I kick a guy and the other guy grabs me because I kicked him, it's frustrating. Okay, so the guns are here. You know what I could do though is, I know guns are really slow. But I could go and get a, uh, get a shotgun real quick. Ugh, that timer does not look good. Um, yeah, I could grab a shotgun and I think the book that 
that um that gets me photos is nice but i think i'd much rather have more firepower Okay, I think I made to hide out before midnight, which is great because now I don't gotta worry about these people. These spells over here. I know Techno Trouble told me to grab some uh, shotguns, so. Buddy, I'm listening to you here. Total complete devastate destruction. Oh god. Okay. I'm gonna drop a second different save point here. I think I'm gonna overwrite the uh, the ending one. And the reason I'm gonna drop a second save point here is because I made it here, but I also have a save point an hour back at the other location. So if I'm not supposed to go here at 12 o'clock, and I'm not supposed to talk to Isabella, at least I have options. I have a lot of firepower, but not a lot of healing. I'd much rather have had more healing. But I don't know if I would have had enough time to run upstairs and grab another healing. I mean, maybe there was a chance I could have done it in 10 minutes? Maybe? It's just cutting it really close. Yeah. <laughs> it's just cutting it really close. Am I supposed to go to the helipod at 12 o'clock? Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do? It's one of those things where I really don't know. And when you don't know... You, you just got to, um... Uh, you just gotta guess. And hope you're going to the right location. If that makes sense. You know, basically say, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Uh, let's go here. And let's pray it's the right way to go. Alright, well... Here come the guys. These guys are dead serious on what they want to do. Now, I think someone told me to uh, talk to Isabella at like 10 a.m. It's not 10 a.m. It's 12. We still have 12 hours before the... Uh... Okay. Cool. Got a cutscene. Fantastic. The military. They'll come, won't they? Just like Santa Cabeza. The government wants to cover this up, too. Okay, uh, what do we do then? Now they changed it all. They never admit when they're at fault. They need at Santa Cabeza, they won't now. She's right, if we die here, the evidence will be covered in the truth. We'll stay in the shadows forever. Nothing will change. That's why we gotta survive. We'll let the military to the work, then make a move. So what, are we just supposed to wait here for like 10 hours? Oh, let me drop another save. Um, this one? Yes. Yes. So maybe I'm supposed to survive until 10 a.m. And then talk to her. So I basically have 10 hours in this hell forsaken world to survive. I think the best thing to do is just not go anywhere. Why am I going down here? Could someone please explain to me why I'm doing this? I mean, 
Like, what am I doing with my life right now? <laughs> I mean, seriously, like, what are we, uh... I don't know, uh... I don't know. I, I feel like one thing I didn't do beforehand is I didn't really fully explore the, uh, uh, the, um, this place, the, the basement. Like when the meat processing was supposed to happen, I was supposed to go back in here to find Brad, but I was told that it might be too late. So maybe I can make my way through these tunnels. The only problem is, in order to get the tunnels, I've got to go through here, and then, which, over here. It's not that far, really, but with machine gunners, it seems like a lot farther than it is. Okay, this is the right way. I see a guy over there. Wow, shotguns do not work on these guys. Oh, this guy just dropped a lot. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, wrong button. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, I'm a horrible shot, I know. But dang it, it's cool. Uh, crud, that's a lot of zombies. Those special forces were supposed to be here. I'm going the wrong way, I need to go this way. Dang it, I went the wrong way. Okay, I need to go this way. I got one. It's fine. I got another one here, hopefully. Machine gun. These are own weapons against them. Ah! Okay, let's head to the, the open area here. A helicopter already? Oh, that's a special forces helicopter, isn't it? Oh, look at all the dead bodies all over the place. Can I take down the helicopter? Oh my god! Danger, Will Robinson! Where'd it go? Oh my god. That thing is just strafing me. Alright, uh, new plan? Run like heck? Run like heck that never, never sounds bad. Oh my god! You should have missed at me! Take that, filthy animal. Literally saw my laugh flash in front of my eyes when those missiles hit the wall behind me. Oh my god, here it comes. Uh, 
I'm screwed, I'm screwed, I'm screwed. I am so, so very screwed. Screwed, screwed, screwed. I am so, so very screwed. I don't think this gun is working. Yeah, I don't think this is working. Like, I tried it. Son of a gun. Now I gotta sit through this. Well, let's actually see what happens if we break out. Yeah, let's see what happens if we break out. Do we get our items back? Because if we don't get our items back, you might as well just load at that point. It's like red light, green light. Because if we have no items or anything, might as well just load. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... It's nice they give me full life, but... I'm spitting at them. That's right, I'm spitting at them. Okay, uh, let's... <laughs> let's rewind. <laughs> let's rewind and, um... Let's rewind it this time. Let's leave the helicopter alone. Because that just doesn't work. Like, it just doesn't work. I thought it was cool. I'm gonna shoot this, uh... Shoot this helicopter out of the sky. With the machine gun. And it fires missiles at me. And it's just like, no, that was not a good plan! Nowhere in any world was that a good idea. I need to pay attention to where these guys are. Because their gun really, really hurts. Oh, wow. I can kill them pretty quick, though. Okay, it may not work on the armor guys. It definitely works on the other guys. First of all, you ran in here. Drama. Dude, I want the armor. That's what I want. Two machine guns. All right, where am I going? Uh, I I want to make it to the plaza. I also want to get another chainsaw because I've been using the ones I've had for a long time. And I want to make sure they don't break on me on the last minute. Oh, this worked out pretty well. These guys have a lot of hit points. Surprise! Okay, where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? I am going up and around, I suppose. I don't know why I'm going up and around, but it's the way we're going at the moment. Oh 
Oh my god, there's three of them. Alright, well that worked! Is this the right way? No, I need to go around. Sweet. So, exchange one chainsaw here. Then go save. There's a lot less uh, zombies here, aren't there? Hit, hit the get out option. It doesn't work all the time like it should. The way they can like chain you is annoying. Legendary soldier. Cool. Great, now there's more of them. And they're chasing me. I think they know I'm here. I mean, I think they know I'm here. Whatever. You know, oh my god, they just spawned right on top of me. I need heals, I need heals, I need heals, I need heals. I need, oh my god, that's a lot of zombies. I liked it better when there was just zombies. But I do give a lot of experience. I mean, that's a ton of experience. Okay, I need to... I need to get back here to get some heals. Then I need to go outside. It's like I'm doing a circle of the uh of the entire place. Okay, okay, okay. Um where am I? I'm not in the right place. No, I need to go up this way still. It is interesting to see a lot more dead zombies around now. Okay, final heal, but I can get some heals up here, and I'm probably going to replace a um, a gun for a uh, another heal. All right. Fortunately, they're guarding the way I need to go. I know there's healing up ahead, so all I have to do is just not die here. And pray they're not up here shooting. What's this? I must be the book that uh, Pete dropped. Looks like you can get extras here. Okay. That wall, I hate that wall, I hate that wall. Let's get a nectar one. Okay, um, let us lose a gun. I think I'll get a ne another nectar one. So I like how they come with the with the bomb effect too. Hmm. 
mean, I'm much rather have the chainsaws than the gun. I think if I run up to enemies, uh, the, the chainsaws are more effective because they also last longer. Would I rather have an extra healing item without a gun? I think I do. Alright. Two chainsaws. A lot of heals. I'm on a mission from God. Let's go. Okay, I think I'm gonna save before I go outside. I can remember what the save point is. Back this way. Back this way, back this way, back this way. I think I just sold up. Oh, and I got an extra pip of health too. Sweet. Yeah, maybe these special forces are worth something after all. Kind of a pain in the butt, but they're worth a ton of experience. I mean, a ton. I didn't mean to go to One Line Plaza. I meant to save. Oh well. I, I could probably get another chainsaw here. Do I need another chainsaw? I don't know. Uh. If I want to get outside, this is not the area I want to go. The, outs the, the problem with outside is you got the, uh, the, the, the freaking helicopter. But I want to go into the maintenance tunnels. Which are... Take a right and then a left. Seems like I always take a pit of damage fighting them. Because there's two of them. By the time I get close enough, but they've already hit me once. Alright, Flightless, what are you going to do about the giant helicopter that's blowing you up? I am going to run like heck is what I'm going to do. I am going to run like absolute heck. Oh god, there it is! It's coming right at us! Oh, well, actually, it ran right above me. Cool. Yeah, yeah, you just keep doing that. Leave me alone. Uh, where is it? I always get lost here. No, I'm going the right way. I'm going the right way. I'm going the right way. The only problem is now I just ran out into the open, and that's a bad idea! I don't think these things are going to provide much cover. So I just need to, like, boogie as fast as I can. Gotta go fast. There's a lot of zombies. This plane is not doing, uh, this helicopter is not doing its job. Got all these things everywhere. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So there's no barricades in a way. Where am I going? Wrong way. That's where I'm going. I was one way to run your car. Golly, that's a lot of zombies. See, Special Forces, this is how you're supposed to do it. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to do it, Special Forces. Learn. 
I'm with the master. Been stuck here for a couple days. I know how to survive. Uh, looks like a thriller movie. Except less cool. Yeah, I don't think um I don't think I can find Brad anywhere. I think he's long gone. Unless there's another way out of here. Uh, I really don't see one. Oh, there's food here? Kind of questionable on that food here, considering the environment. I mean, only an idiot would drink out of this milk. I mean, who knows where it's been? Dang it, I'm thirsty. Sweet. I didn't die. That's a good start. I don't see any other way out of this uh, area. Yeah. I would love to use a maintenance van. Can't work. Can't use it. Maybe I can use this one. Sweet! Oh my god. Alright, where am I going now? Um. I don't know. Did I just check out areas I haven't been before? I, I, could all the, I could go all the way down here, for example. Or I could go wherever this is. I think that's where I started. So why don't I check wherever this is? I don't know how I got out of that car consumed where I was at. Oh, there's no one in here. That's that's a nice fresh change. Meetings tunnel. Have I ever been here before? It's locked. I need the maintenance tunnel key to open it. Well, where the heck is the maintenance tunnel key at? Okay. Wrong door. Oh wait, that just took me upstairs, didn't it? Like this is just a circle that I just did. Yeah, I just did a giant circle. Can't use this. Can't use that. God, I'm screwed. Being stuck down here with no um, car is a death sentence. Yeah, this this is when you know you've completely gone insane. When you come down here and you decide to go mono and mono on the entire zombie horde. This is when you know you've lost it. What's in here? What's behind door number two? 
Another locked maintenance tunnel. You know, I'm just saying it would be really nice if I knew where this key was. Let's go down here next. And we're exploring. We're exploring without a car. Surrounded by zombies. And by surrounded by zombies, I mean... There's about a million of them and there's about one of me. My favorite zombie is the one pushing sopping carts. It just cracked me up. It's like, what are you doing? Ah! There's a lot of them right here. Well, hello. How they get up here then? That door was unlocked. How did they get up here? What time is it? It's 3:30. I was supposed to get to Isabella by 10. It's a really bad idea running around these maintenance tunnels. I have no idea how to get out of here. I, I can't get. I can't go out through one of the doors. I mean, the smart thing to do would be just uh, completely bu bubble double back, but you know, I'm really stupid, or really stubborn, or really zombie bait. Not sure which. Maybe all the above. Maybe some of the above. Maybe definitely all the above. Yeah, it's it's, it's all the above. I'd much rather have fought the uh, the guys with the guns. Because at least the guys with the guns, uh, they gave them a lot of XP. These guys, not so much. Oh, nice judo kick there. That just saved my life too, because those guys are about to blow me up. Huh. Uh, I guess I'll try this door next. And one of these doors got to be unlocked, right? I'm trying to be like, uh... Lee and Clementine. Stumbling about. Shambling. Trying to act like them. But you know what? It, it, it isn't really working, but I haven't been touched yet. So maybe it is. See, every time I do the drop kick, I end up getting screwed because of it. Well, at least for some reason, we're running a lot faster now. I don't know what just, like, kicked him himself into gear, but something did. Why are you all up here? Please be unlocked. Please. Oh, God. It's gonna be like seven hours of me just stuck running in circles in the maintenance tunnels because I can't get out of them and I don't have a car. To go back the other way. I need to hit that one next. But some reason I can't drive these things. Yeah, go up around this way, hit that one. Then we'll go over here. Even though it looks like a dead end. Probably just where Kalido put a bomb. Yep, up that way. Going the right way. I'm telling you, there's probably a survivor. That I was supposed to save, that had a key. Because I didn't save the survivor, I didn't get the key. 
Maybe it was the uh, the butcher guy. Maybe I was supposed to save one of his victims, and they give me the uh, uh, a key. You know, if I could just get back to Paradise Plaza, uh, there's infinite health restores in the um in the upstairs drink station. So what I could do is I could just farm the uh farm the crazy guys, the the, the spec op guys. And I could gain a ton of EXP. And I could have infinite heals. Okay, next one's over here. Oh, there's a car here! Oh, thank God. Ah, dang it! I was about to say, watch. That's gonna be the one that door. That's gonna be the one door that does unlock because there's a car outside. At least there's a car outside. And that surely was the zombie chasing me. It's time to ruin this beautiful car. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna go up this way to see what's up there. Seems like a suspicious spot, unless it's a, um... Unless it's where one of Carlito's bombs are. There's like no one over here. This is freaky. Yeah, that's one where that's where one of Carlito's bombs were. Alright, let's get the heck out of here because there is nothing in these maintenance tunnels. Uh, uh is it here? Was it here? Don't know. Just take the next intersection, whatever the next intersection is. Heck? What is this? The heck is this? Sledgehammers? Traffic cones? Maintenance tunnel key? Oh my gosh! I've been looking for something like that! Sweet! Now I can go through the maintenance tunnels. Do I need to go through the main cells though? When we got the car, I just want to get the heck out of here, don't we? Well, the good news is the main tunnel key is another way to get around this area. And that, it can't be a bad thing. Yeah, let's get into a convertible. Oh, there's a helicopter firing at you. Just don't think this is the smartest move, Flightless. I mean, that car may be damaged as heck, but at least I had a cover to it. Well, this thing's fast, so maybe I can, like, fly past the... As long as I don't hit any uh, tree stumps. Where am I going? I, I need to go back here. Back here. Well, it's a thing. That's a thing. I'm almost there, though. What time is it? It's almost five. And I gotta get to her by ten. So basically, as long as I leave here by. 738 I should be fine. Oh my god. Those are missiles following me aren't they? I think they are okay. The cool thing about this place is 
This place will allow me to uh, go get another chainsaw as well. Hi! Oh, hi. Go away. Thanks off the menu. Oh my god, that was so risky what I just did there. That was so risky. See, if I can get the Spec Ops guys to come up here, I can heal infinitely. So I really haven't had any story or anything in this episode. I mean, I ran around the mall hoping to find something, you know, either survivors or missions or a phone call or, you know, basically anything. And I found Zilch. I don't think these gun guys spawn as much as I think they do. As much as I hope they do. Like, I hear them. I just heard someone call my name. Guess not. Maybe I need to reload the area to make more respawn. This doesn't seem to be the most... Oh, wait. You know what would be a good idea? You know what would be a good idea to go to the, um... The, uh... The meat locker area. Not the meat locker area. The... To go to the um the area where I can get meat, the uh the, the, the supermarket. I like go to the supermarket and I can eat meat there. So just like here I have infinite uh health. I wonder if these guys keep respawning right here. I think they do. I think they do. Yeah, these guys, like, infinitely respawn right here. So if I load in and load out, I can do this for about an hour. Not an hour of real time, an hour of game time. But, I mean, it's almost six. I'm trying to think how long I need to do to get to Isabella. I'd much rather wait two hours at Isabella than level up some more and miss her. Oh, they're not here. Hmm. Just when I thought I had all the answers, they had to change the questions. Alright, let's do this one more time. And then we'll go get food. Uh, we'll, we'll go re-heal ourselves. <laughs> I hope this is a chainsaw I've been using all along. It's the one thing I wish I could see how many attacks my chainsaw has left. Alright. Wow, I jumped over that guy's bullets. Oh my god, there's six of them. 
Oh my god, I almost died. I almost died. But I ended up leveling up instead. Oh, item stock increased to 10? Okay, do I want to grab another health kit or do I want to grab another chainsaw? I think I grabbed another health kit. This chainsaw seemed to last a long time. Right, I'm actually still using the same chainsaw the entire time. But I think grabbing another health is better. And I'm gonna grab um, an untouchable. Yeah, life is so much better when you have a lot of uh, item stocks. Like, life is so much easier. Y'all see him anywhere? I don't see him anywhere. You know there's like a survival mode? But you apparently have to like survive in the mall for 14 real time hours. Can't you just grab a bunch of food and just hop on this ailing? And then when you need to run up the stairs, grab some food and jump on the ailing. And then we need to jump up, you know, can't you just do this and just wait out the 14 hours? It'd be boring as heck. But I mean, it, 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 it should work, right? I, I hate having to charge at them because when you charge at them they get um, a chance to shoot you It's like it's much better to like sneak up on them like this. Oh, nope that didn't work But but you know what I, I mean like the idea if you can catch them by surprise Okay. Hmm. <laughs> uh, let's save? Flightless? No, let's not use a save. Um, let's, uh, let's look. Day four, 147. Day three, 23. Let's save under this one. I think at this point in the game, having multiple save points is not a bad idea. Because if I screwed up somewhere, it's a lot easier to load a previous save than it is to restart the whole brand new game. That guy got double shot on me. That really sucked. Wow! They saw me jump down! They really are special forces. Okay, so the game plan is I'm gonna get shotgun. Uh, not shotgun, a new chainsaw. Yeah, I'm gonna get a new chainsaw. And hopefully I'm not gonna die here because this is a big open area. And for some reason they're not firing at me like they probably should. I will take it. Okay, got a new chainsaw. Special force on the right. Give me no time to react. Do I have, is it too risky to try to make it to the, um, to the, uh, the, the, the supermarket? Maybe. Maybe it is. But I don't want to use one of my drinks. But unless you're acting very, very stupid right now. I know, I know, I know. Not far though. Oh, all the, what the heck is going on here? These bodies are just floating now. Cool.
Come on, don't die, don't die, don't die! No! I was so close! Alright, well, here's the thing. All I had to do is get... Um, I believe I saved right before I got the shotgun. I mean, not the shotgun, the chainsaw. So I had to do is go back up, get the chainsaw, uh, then boogie it to that area. And I think this is where we're going to pick up the next episode, my dear friends. I'm sorry this didn't have a lot of story or plot. I mean, part of me is thinking maybe I should just, like, cut this episode entirely. But a, a lot of you guys said uh, surviving the mall is a story in itself. So... Yeah, I guess we just got to make our own story here as we go. But hey, I love you guys so very much. Hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. And I will see you again very soon on our Continue Blind Let's Play Dead Rising for PlayStation. Until then, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved. And you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.